I'm with leading trainer Ray Holberton. Uh, Ray, uh, safe to say you've been around the industry for a while and uh, you're the son of Albie Holberton. That's correct, yeah, he's my father. Um, he's deceased now, but a very one of the best trainers you've ever seen. He's a horseman, and that's what lacks today. And he was an ambassador for the sport too. You know, everyone knew Albie. He was an ambassador, and he also helped a lot of lads. It was in need, in trouble in the streets. He brought them home, looked after them, showed them what it's all about, and they went on and been a trainer. Just... Who's got that green cap with the pom pom? Uh, no, I think it's um, that went with him. I think <laughs> they went with him. They had to go with him. He loved that hat. Loved it. He did, and it was a, 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 a call signal for him, really, wasn't it? It was, because his colours are green and gold, and everything is. I use his colours today, and that was his favourite colours, green and gold. Now, that little filly uh, plugged away pretty well today. Um, had a bit of luck from the second row, but she didn't turn it up. No, she never turned up. She's a funny filly. I've only had her two weeks. Um, she hurt herself in the float, and we patched her up, and that's her first run for us. I'm very happy. She's only a three-year-old. Well, she's got a future, and um, look, you've had some good horses in your time. Can you tell us about a couple of them? Oh, well, HQ, I got her from uh, Matthew um, Harding, and she ended up winning 87000 She ran second last year in the Queen Pacific, which was brilliant, $100,000 race at Melton. Uh, Cullen Sobey won the kindergarten. He won, won the size produce, won 21 races for me. Very good horse. Um, just had a lot of, you know, average good handy horses. Yeah, well, I mean, everyone's looking for their champion, but if you get a stable full of those, um, you know, you've made a good living, and, uh, and that's what you look for, isn't it? That's correct. We've been averaging 20 to 30 wins a year, so I'm happy with that. Ray, um, you're the president of Botra and have been on uh, Botra for uh, some time. Yeah, I've been president of the Botra for the last four years. I've been on the Botra for the last six. Um, we've turned it around. It was defunct, but now it's, um, it's kicked the goal. Well, it's long-standing too. I mean, I can remember Botra from the Wavell days. It was very strong then. It was a union of uh, racing, trotting in this state. Now it's um, starting to get its name back. Ray, and you're also a committeeman of the uh, of the club, SA Harness Racing Club. Yeah, I took that on. I don't know why. I'm training, you know, 13 horses and the botcher. That takes a fair bit and then of the committee. But my heart's in trotting and, and you had to go that way. Well, I was about to say that. Um, look, it's good to have someone on committees that are from the grassroots. I think you got to. Like, I'm no degree in science, whatever, but I'm a good handy man, hands on. And I think that you've got to have them. Well, I, you know, I didn't see any CV about being a degree in science, but you, you need to be a harness racing man, and you sure are that. That's correct. That's correct. Ray, thanks for your time. All the best for the future, and uh, uh, keep those young ones coming up. Thanks very much for the interview. Ladies and gentlemen, leading trainer, Ray Holberton.